Adewale, a brave and noble young hunter, known for his skill and his deep sense of duty to his family and village. Adabisi, a beautiful and spirited maiden, daughter of the village chief, caught between her heart's desires and her father's expectations. Chief Oleinka, Adabisi's father, a stern and traditional leader who values the customs and traditions of their people above all else. Afunsatan, a cunning and ambitious rival suitor who seeks Adabisi's hand in marriage for power and status. Central conflict. Adewale and Adabishi fall deeply in love, but their relationship faces immense obstacles. Chief Olayinka has promised Adabishi to Afunsatan, a man of wealth and influence, in order to secure an alliance that would strengthen their village's standing. Adewale, despite his noble character and love for Adabisi, lacks the wealth and status that Chief Olayinka deems necessary. The lovers must navigate a labyrinth of tradition, deception, and betrayal to be together. Story, outline. Opening scene, the village and the baobab tree. The camera pans over a serene Yoruba village, rich with traditional huts and the vibrant colors of daily life. It centers on a majestic baobab tree at the heart of the village, a symbol of life and community. Narrator. In a land where the baobab tree stood as a witness to time, two hearts dared to defy the traditions that bound them. This is the story of Adewale and Adebisi, whose love blossomed beneath the branches of the ancient tree. Scene one, the meeting under the baobab tree. Adewale and Adebisi meet in secret, their faces lit with love and hope. Narrator, their eyes met one fateful day, and from that moment, Adewale and Adebisi knew their hearts belonged to each other. But love in the shadows of tradition is fraught with peril. Scene two, a father's decision. In Chief Olayinka's hut, adorned with cultural artifacts like drums, masks, and woven mats, he discusses Adebisi's future with Afunsatan. Narrator, Chief Olayinka, a man of unwavering tradition, had promised Adebisi to Afunsatan, a suitor of wealth and ambition. The chief believed this union would fortify their village's future. Scene three, the lover's dilemma. Adewale and Adebisi sit beneath the baobab tree, dressed in traditional attire, discussing their impossible situation. Narrator, bound by duty but driven by love, Adewale and Adebisi sought a way to change their fate. They vowed to fight for their love, even if it meant defying the customs that held them captive. Scene four, deception and betrayal. Efun Seitan, dressed in elaborate traditional robes, plots against Adewale, using deceit to turn the village against him. Narrator, Efun Seitan, sensing the threat to his plans, wove a web of lies to discredit Adewale. His betrayal ran deep, threatening not only their love, but also the harmony of the village. Scene five. The climax Adewale, in his hunter's attire, confronts Chief Olayinka and Afunsatan in the village square, a place bustling with villagers in traditional dress. Narrator. With courage burning in his heart, Adewale stood before the village, proclaiming his love for Adebisi and challenging the traditions that bound them. The village watched in breathless anticipation. Scene six, resolution. The baobab tree stands tall as the village reconciles, with Adewale and Adebisi united in love, and Chief Olayinka accepting their union. Narrator. In the end, love's strength shattered the chains of